What's going on guys? Hope we're all having a fantastic day. The PTB for the new chapter is out. So this is a crossover with For Honor, although they are original characters. We've got a new killer, a new survivor, and also a new map, which is pretty cool. We're going to go ahead and run through all of the new perks, and I'm going to take a look at the killer's power, and then we're going to go ahead and just jump into a game. So starting off with our new survivor, Vittorio Toscano, I believe that's how you pronounce his name. We've got three new perks that come along with him. So the first one is Potential Energy. This is a perk where when you work on a generator, you get tokens from 1 to 20. And the amount of tokens you have is the amount of percent you can put into a generator. So if you have one token, it'll bump it up 1%. If you have 20, 20%. But if you get hit without using the tokens, then you lose all the tokens that the perk has. Next is Fogwise. So when you hit a great skill check while repairing a generator, it reveals the killer's aura for six seconds. Kind of like a reverse gearhead, really cool. I think it's gonna be really strong. And lastly is Quick Gambit. When you're chased within 24 meters of any generator that a survivor is working on, that survivor receives an 8% speed boost to the repair action. Overall, I think it's pretty cool. I like the new survivor. I love his look and I think his perks are going to be interesting. We'll have to play around with them and see. Let's go ahead and take a look at the killer now. Obviously, we got the night killer and his three perks are nowhere to hide. Whenever you damage a generator, you can see all survivors within a 24 meter range of that gen for five seconds. Hex face the darkness. When you injure a survivor, a dull totem will turn into a hex totem. While the hex is active, all survivors outside of your terror radius will scream intermittently and reveal their auras. Aside from the survivor, you hit to activate the hex. And lastly, we got hubris. Whenever you are stunned by a survivor, that survivor is exposed for 20 seconds and hubris has a cooldown of 20 seconds. Again, overall, I think they're really interesting perks and I'm really excited to play around with them. The next new change to this chapter, big change at least, is we've got bots in custom matches now. So I can just click here and I can add as many bots as I want. And I can have a full game without having to wait in an hour long queue. So I am going to do that. Let's go ahead and see how this killer works. All right, so we got the new map. I actually just recorded a game and then I realized at the end I forgot to record the game audio, so back at it. Let's try it again. I am a little mad because I've got food in the microwave and now it's going cold. But it'll be fine. Hey, there's a Jake. Alright, so these AI are pretty interesting. Let's see how he plays this. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> what is that? I don't even need to use my power here, but I will. All right, so I'm gonna put that there. This is actually the smart thing to do, kind of like Dredge, just run away. If people try to play a loop, you can just set a guard down on a very short patrol path. And if they run into that part of them at all, then they get down. Really nice. I saw somebody scream over there. There's our hex perk getting some value. Didn't see their aura though. We'll keep an eye out. Throw him up there. So there are three different kinds of summons you can do. One like extends the range of the detection and one moves faster and one like kicks gens and pallets faster, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. And they kind of cycle through. And I believe that is indicated by the, like, green color thing. Like, right here, there's a sword near my hands. Let's go ahead and put somebody over here. Any detections? Doesn't seem like it. Okay, let's kick this and see if we can get the aura reading perk. Or anybody in a 24 meter range? Doesn't look like it. Damn, these bots are doing gens! I can't even find anybody! They're too good at stealthing! Hey, dooters, what is up? So I can do this, and I can actually, like, go through the windows and pallets, too. Alright. Yerk! Okay, he detected the Jake. 
<laughs> this guy's playing like my teammate. Look at him go! He's after the Jake! Oh, he got Jake! Jake got injured! I actually really like this idea. It's like you can pressure two survivors at once. Kind of like artists in a way. I know he doesn't play anything like artists, but that con. Oh, hello! We see an Ellie! Okay, let's see. Is she gonna try and actually like loop anything? Here, let's put him like here. No? He didn't get her? These scratch marks are so hard to see. Okay, I know someone's over there. Does that mean the unhook's coming in, or is that just still on the hook? Nope, there it is. Good looping. She's looping. She's a god. Look at her go. I wonder if they're, like, trying to heal over here. Let's go ahead and just, like, make a little pass. Oh no, it's the bill! I didn't mean to chase the bill again. Well, it's not a real person. It doesn't count as tunneling, right? I hope they lighten up the colors on the map. Or just make it less red. Just so scratch marks stand out better. Oh, someone's over here. Okay. Oh, they're upstairs. Ah! Look at her. See, can, can we get someone to, like, drop down? Doesn't seem like it. Where is this guy? Kick that! The aura readings? is very strange. Hey, we found somebody. That took a while. Hey, we can get a free hit. Let's send the night after. Her. Our power comes back so fast when we do it. Never mind. That isn't even what I was trying to say. I meant to say the patrol is so much longer when you do a short phase like that. I don't know what else to call it other than a phase. Someone is upstairs. Okay, let's make like a whole circle. Or like here and drop down. It won't let me drop down. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, so I can't drop. This shack? This shack. These survivors just hold W, don't they? Done me. Come on, Jake. No, don't go to the seawall. It's not even a seawall. It's like a weird single L wall. Yeah, the AIs tend to just vault the windows over and over again. This is a cool map. I feel like the loops are pretty standard. I don't think I have a problem with it. It's just very big. Wish it was a little smaller. Or dark, that's what she said. I'm gonna say it first before the comments do. Now ah, they're gone. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> sure, dog. I wonder if that was because the young Jin took the window. And I was like, oh no. So I can also send this guy to come and kick this gen, so I don't have to do it. That's really nice. Okay, let's see. Can we get him to stun us here? Stun me. Stun me. Okay. Let's let's get some use out of hubris. Yeah! Dude, the bot almost spun me. Almost got my ankle shattered by a bot. Oh, we can mori. Let's take him to a good, good place for the Mori. I have already seen this, but I love it. Oh no, it's in the wall! 
is really sick. Alright, only slightly censored, Mori. Hey, there they are. Looping with friends! We're looping with friends! Okay, let's send... Can I summon the guard? Please? I don't know. I'm just sending it that way. They're both over here. Okay, she went nowhere. That guy, that guy found Elity. Let's see, let's see if he can get her. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Is he gonna make it? Oh, he didn't make it. Ugh. Okay, we'll try it again. Oh, she's out of here, isn't she? Oh, someone's over here. They're both back there. That's where they were. Let's get him. Injure her too. Okay. If I go this way and follow her. Can we get her? Can we get her? Get her! Get her! Get her! Now she went back! Where are you going? <laughs> this is obviously not the most efficient way to play him. I could just down her, but <laughs> I wanted to see that. Oh my gosh, that's so funny. Let's bring her over here. We'll get a better Mori shot, hopefully. There we go. So awesome. So cool. Where's she going? Back here. Alright. Let's put the knight there. Get her! Get her ass! Get her! Go, go, go! Nice! Nice! I love it! I think he's got super strong zoning potential for sure. Whether or not he can keep up that pressure, that's another question. <laughs> and all that's left is Jake. Oh, the hatch was right here. He got it. <laughs> what is this run? <laughs> His run's almost as funny as Wesker's. Oh my gosh, that's hilarious. Alright guys, that's gonna do it for this video. Thank you so much for watching, I appreciate it. Hit that like and subscribe button down below so I can keep making content like this and share the video with a friend because I want more subscribers, obviously. But thank you guys once again and I will see you in the next one. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your night.